So I'm a little bit hungover. Amber just went to the toilet. And I've just been stood at baggage for about five minutes waiting for our baggage. Oh, no, you did. <laughs> just to remember that we didn't bring any baggage. We just got our backpacks. We've got our backpacks because this is a budget holiday in one of the cheapest European countries. So we're here to explore for four days. So let the journey begin. Amber's trying to learn how to say thank you. It's on, babes. Kusanam. Kusanam. Doesn't sound Hungarian, does it? Not really in your face, I don't know really. Hungarian really sounds like, but it doesn't sound like that. Yeah. So we're just walking down to Dean College Hotel, which we paid £35 pounds for, which is really reasonable, and this is the room. So now we're just heading up to some dinner at a cute little Italian restaurant that we found. Basically, the Italian was closed, so I've got a falafel wrap, and Ben's gonna get McDonald's. <laughs> a little bit of protein for the journey. Naughty bit of brownie. Oy. Maybe like took 20 minutes to hike from the bottom of the bridge all the way up to the top of here so we'll get some views in a minute and it's really warm. <laughs> It was it was built in the 19th century. It was what are you doing? Bro? So we're heading. <laughs> so we're heading. <laughs> we are heading. <laughs> Oh, 
we've done one of my favourite things and got a Starbucks. Now we're going to go and do one of Amber's favourite things and head to the spa, which is the Roman spa, isn't it? No, the Ruda spa. The Ruda spa. So we're finished at the castle. Big day plan for us, starting with a cat cafe, which is free to enter, and then we're gonna go to a thrift shop, which is like vintage shopping. Um, apparently, Budapest is quite well known for that. And then we're gonna go to another spa, <laughs> and then a cruise. living a dream aren't you babe? Yeah the cat cafe is a must do well in Budapest. The cats are really friendly and you have a nice coffee and sandwich here and I'm obsessed with cats and maybe you are too that's why you're coming here. <laughs> she tried she actually tried to get through there. <laughs> no to, I just had a look. She's trying to become a cat. I was like getting on my all so I was like <laughs> vintage shop now hopefully get some new clobber new bit of swag it's called retro rock vintage store Myself a funky pair of leggings. I'll be wearing them to teach my yoga classes. It's just a little souvenir from Budapest. So we recommend that you go there, grab yourself a little vintage item. Now we are off to the best spa in Budapest.
day got cut a bit short because there was a bomb scare but it wasn't that bad though we thought they were closing so we were like jumping in all the pools trying to be a bit cheeky <laughs> get a bit longer trying to get our use out of it we had 20 more minutes we were like what is going on <laughs> On a scooter, two on one, nearly had a crash into like a few pedestrians, a few casualties, but <laughs> she, she's very stressed out. We missed our cruise ship, didn't we? So. Yeah, we missed our cruise, um, but luckily they rescheduled it for tomorrow. It was with Get Your Guide, so we recommend that company. We paid like eight pounds um, for a drink and a boat trip down the river for one hour. Couldn't get on our boat, so we came to look at some trains instead. Good morning, we're just enjoying our iced coffee, as we are coffee lovers, on the rooftop um, of Dean's College Hotel, which gives a really nice view of Budapest, which we'll show you. Then we're just going to head down to the market hall and try some traditional Hungarian food, and then see some landmarks on some bicycles. Um, because my legs are really hurting because we're doing so much walking and Ben just has the most longest legs ever so they're not hurting him <laughs> and then we're going to go to Castle Park and view some historical buildings that apparently seem really pretty so let's go traditional Hungarian munch. Krem de Krem. Munch. Munch. <laughs> I haven't eaten today. Ben's had two croissants and a bagel. One of the croissants was yours. You chose not to eat it, so I had to take one for the team and eat two croissants. I need to save my appetite for the food here. So we're currently on the hunt for some ilagos. No, no it's, langos. <laughs> it's called langos. I don't know if langos. we're saying that correctly. It's a traditional Hungarian. Um, it's like dough with deep fried dough that is topped with butter, cheese and sour cream. So we're on a hunt to find that. We've got our langos. Langos, if we say that correctly, and some fresh lemonade. I'll just pick it up, babes. Get in there. Oh, I don't know. Eat it like you eat it at home. I might actually put it in my fingers and go. Come on, babes. I need to use antibacterial. Oh. Wait, stop, stop that one. Antibacterial. <laughs> I know it is struggling. These plastic isn't? knife and forks like break. But it's gonna fling over there and hit someone on the head. <laughs> Very elegant babes. It's like three in the afternoon and I have There's a lot going on. And sweet bread. Sweet bread. And cheese. <laughs> Great description. Makes it savoury. <laughs> That's good. You have to try it. Like, it's good to try the food whatever you go. So. Yeah. So we finished our. <laughs> right. 
What is it called? Lagos. Langos. I don't know Langos. if that's how you say it, but... Langos. Yeah, we, we both feel a bit sick. I feel like I've eaten the world's biggest donut. We had one each. It was too much. So we're just a bit bloated and Ben's rubbing his big belly. Rubbing your belly. City, so they made these abandoned buildings into like funky bars. So we're gonna go inside and have a drink.
Gullet. It's like a really posh one. I'm not pronouncing that correctly at all. But it's literally at the end of the blue bridge. And it has an outside area as well, which we're excited for because it's really sunny. up at the spa now we have two hours till our flight i'm a little bit stressed two and a half two and a half do this all day all day so we're gonna get the lamb scooters to the bus bus to the airport plane to england Boo. hey